Franz Reichardt in 1912. I love that we're getting pictures now. This dude looks like a vampire hunter. That is a crisp photo for 1912. Known as the Flying Tailor. Here we go again. <laughs> Reichelt was testing a coat parachute he had designed. He fell to his death, <laughs> leaping from the deck of the Eiffel Tower. All right, that's kind of funny. His parachute seemed to have only opened halfway and folded around him immediately. He fell for a few seconds before striking the frozen soil at the foot of the tower, and it was reported that his right leg and arm were crushed, his skull and spine broken, and that he was bleeding from the mouth, nose, and ears. During an autopsy, it was concluded that Reichelt died of a heart attack during his fall. <laughs> That is insane. He's like, ah, 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 ah. that is fucking insane. People are like, he's, it's beautiful. He would have just been like dead floating. Reichelt was trying to create a way for pilots to survive a fall out of an aircraft. Reichelt had promised the authorities that he would use a dummy, but at the last moment, he strapped himself into the garment and jumped off in front of a camera crew. To get wrapped up in that would suck. To have a heart attack and then plummet to your death also would be equally as tragic.